Okay. The next party registered is the ACGP. Thank you, Chairperson. It is shameful to see the hypocrisy, inconsistency, and double standards practiced by some in this country. Yesterday, when members spoke in support of amendment bills dealing with gender-based violence, which the ACDP supported, they said people should spread love and not hatred. But when it comes to Israel and Palestinian conflict, they spread hatred and anti-Semitic venom rather than spread love and dialogue. The ACDP calls on the minister and the Department of International Relations and Cooperation to set a good example for South Africans and lead government in unbiased mediation efforts that will produce lasting peace and good neighborliness. The South African government must stop their support for haters of Jews who are dreaming about the removal of Jews from the face of the earth, which will never happen. Derko must first get its house in order and deal with their wasteful expenditure amounting to billions of rands before trying to be champions of condemners of Israel. They must tell us what happened to their 118 million rents that was paid to purchase a non-existent piece of land in New York. They must tell us what the Director General Kabo Mahwai was suspended for when he was not yet a DG and therefore not directly involved in the New York pilot project saga. The ACDP demands transparency and accountability from the department and the minister, without which the ACDP will not support this budget vote six, nor subsequent budget. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, the party registered is the ANC. Chairperson, the NFP had also registered. Uh, honorable members, it's not here, but I will allow you. Thank you very much. The National Freedom Party will support the budget vote. But let me uh, say to the House uh, Chairperson, I see a very high level of hypocrisy on some members who talk about uh, human rights, uh, protecting the human rights, and yet they are supporting the human rights violations of the Palestinian people. And yet they know very well that pre they know ever Jews had gone, they've been expelled from many countries all over the world that created and in there because they were not wanted anywhere in the world. They know for a fact that Jews does not comply with it. They know for a fact that Jews, Muslims, and Christians have been living side by side in peace and tranquility until the state of Israel was created on Palestinian land. They know that as well. But they ignore all these things. And let me tell you why they ignore it, Shepherds. They, they ignore it. They ignore it, Chairperson, because these are the very some people who sell their principles and values because they are being funded by Israel. And that is why they would do that. The National Freedom Party will support Chair this uh, report at uh, the, 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 the uh, international relations table here today. Thank you. Honorable members on the virtual platform, I think you can see my face there. And when I speak, even if you can hear me, you are able to see me. Sure. When I call for your name, it means I want you to stop. There was a point of order in the house and I wanted to allow Honorable Swart before you could conclude. Even if you have done so, I will allow Honorable Swart because you didn't hear me. Chairperson, it was difficult to hear, but if I heard the Honorable Member, he made some extremely anti-Semitic comments about Jewish people. And I would ask you to study the record and rule on that because I would submit it is highly unparliamentary and we are seeing increased anti-Semitism across the world and in South Africa. 
Thank and you. I would urge all no, don't that you debate. Look at don't Thank debate. You, you, you told that. me that we will must look into Thank it you. and we will do that.